What's going on, Fleck? Like, welcome back to another video. My name is Creek, and today, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Jade Key in Roblox Phantom Forces. So, there's two maps that you can do the first part on the highway map and the crane map. Right here in this little video, I'm inside the crane map, and what you have to do is find a green vending machine. There's one on each of these two maps. We're on the crane map here in this video, and right next to the crane is this little building. And if you go into this building, there's going to be a green vending machine. And on the green vending machine is, well, basically, light boxes or little blocks and what you have to do is you have to make the entire gray uh, grid gray you have to turn off all the lights and how it works is every time you shoot a block all the blocks around that get activated or deactivated depending on whether they're already on or off and it's basically a little puzzle and honestly i don't really know how to solve the puzzle all right i tried looking it up i spent like an hour trying to solve this thing and i i couldn't really do it i just kind of shot it until it randomly worked for me and uh basically just keep shooting it or if you're good with the puzzle then you'll you'll figure it out but right here you see i i deactivated all the blocks and I got the special Jade Key item. Now, the special Jade Key item, it's not actually the Jade Key. What it is, is it's a melee weapon inside the game. You can go into your inventory and you can set it and it'll basically replace your knife. And so, as you can see right here in the game, I've got a little Jade Key melee weapon I can run around and attack people with. But once you have that, what you want to do is go on the suburban map. All right, it's a little neighborhood house map. And go into this middle house right here in the middle. It's a light blue house. And in this house, you'll see here in a minute, there's a little keyhole on one of the doors. And what you're going to do is use the key to activate that keyhole. Now, real quick, while I'm searching for it in the video, and you can you can laugh at me because I'm just basically hitting all the walls with the key. There's a few things to note. First things first, all right, once you have the key, you can switch servers, all right? It'll save your progress. Once you have the Jade Key item, you can switch servers, no problemo, all right? But if you switch servers while you're figuring out the grid puzzle, you do have to restart. But once you have the key, you're good to go. But inside this room right here, inside the light blue house, this little blue room, right on this door is a little keyhole. Smack the door with the key, and then you're going to be teleported to the final part of this uh, Easter egg mission challenge thing for the Jade Key. And what it is, is it's basically Call of Duty zombies and phantom forces so if you've ever played call of duty zombies before you should be good to go it's a little map you can run around you have infinite ammo you have an assault rifle you have a shotgun you have three grenades and after every round uh your health regenerates uh, a little bit not all the way but just a little bit i think it's like 50 percent or 25 percent so uh try not to take damage all right if you die you have to restart all over all right and you have to go find the the keyhole again but basically what you have to do is it's called to do zombies you have to survive seven rounds of zombies after the seventh round you're going to get the key so you can basically just run around the entire map you know take out all the zombies just like i'm doing here it's basically call of duty zombies and then once you take out all the zombies and you take out the very last one on i think the seventh round you're going to be awarded the jade key just like that and then to equip the jade key all you got to do go to your roblox profile go to your avatar and then inside your helmet section you should have the jade uh, helmet or the silver one depending on if you get it right now or the copper one if you get it later on but that is gonna be it for this video hopefully it helped you guys out a short little video showing you guys how to get the jade key inside of roblox a lot easier than the copper one very very simple if you can figure out this little puzzle thing here it, it, it's it's a lot a lot easier than the jailbreak one all you got to do figure out this puzzle i recommend going on like a small server with not a lot of people you can use the roblox plus plugin for that or do it late at night and then just go in solve that puzzle and uh, once you solve the puzzle you'll get the key once you get the key you can go on the neighborhood map put it in the door and then once you're there just complete the zombie round and you'll be good to go so hopefully this video helped you guys out if it did be sure to hit that like button hit the subscribe button guys click the bell icon turn on your notifications we're gonna have tons of videos going over all the keys all the dominus all that stuff so if you want to learn how to get the keys or how to get the dominus or you want to get the dominus first all that good stuff make sure that you subscribe with your bell icon ticked all right your notifications on in stream this morning we're gonna be actually doing a stream 10 a.m est we're gonna be doing a stream and we're gonna be trying to find the last key guys before we get the dominus it is the crystal key and i think i might know where it's at so uh, tune in to our streams it's gonna be awesome make sure you're subscribed again bell icon take notifications on hope you guys have a great day hope this video helped if it did share it out tell your friends family grandma all that good stuff and i'll see you guys next time bye